Morning everyone. Morning. <laughs> um, so today is our last day um, and we are going on the High Line. Yeah. Um, and then we're going to Chelsea Market to hopefully get some, is it tacos? Yeah. Ooh, yeah. Um, what else did they do there? I did loads of stuff at Chelsea Market. Okay. So it might be yeah. a lot of food in this video. Um, and then we are heading back to Nintendo oh. store. Um, hopefully trying to get what we actually came for because they were sold out last time. And then I think it'll be another trip to Magnolia Bakery. <laughs> oh, we can't, can we? We can't <laughs> um, have any more. Yeah, we ate the entire um, vanilla banana pudding. Yeah. And then the Chuck Hazelnut run this morning for breakfast. Nice and healthy. Yeah, nice and nutritional. Nutritional? Is, Nutri that, is, is that, that a word? No, it's not. Nutritious? Nutritious is Nutritious. a word. Nutritional isn't. This is what happens when Laurie makes me do the talking because I forget what I'm trying to say. You forget how to talk? Yeah, I forget how to talk. <laughs> <laughs> um, and then we're going for our steak meal tonight. Yes. Um, Club A steak Club house. A steakhouse, yeah. Um, so hopefully try and get a porthouse for two. Um, and then I'd quite like to go back to Dutch Kills yeah. for a drink this evening. Um probably one of my favourite bars out here. Yeah, it's good, isn't it? Yeah, it's really nice. So um, hopefully head back there. Um, won't be going back to the back room. No, after I've, the, um... <laughs> I've stopped throwing my toys out the pram <laughs> now. I, I still think that's right, though. Like, if, you've, if you've mistakenly charged someone's card um, when they told you they're paying cash, you shouldn't then run out the bar talking about a, a tip. Okay, yeah, you don't even... I, I, I always tip. 100% always tip, and last night I and forgot. always tip more as well. Yeah, I'd always, I always tip more than 20%. Um, last night, where he just charged my card, it completely threw me off track. So I just literally picked my card up and walked out. Didn't think of tipping. Um, where I normally pay cash, I would tip on top. Um, but then he come running out when we was in the restaurant saying, oh, oh, oh uh, mm -hmm. you haven't tipped and you haven't signed. And uh, No, I'm sorry. I, I, as good as it was in there, that really... So I'm still annoyed by it now. Well, you're a bit more annoyed about your jeans. Yeah, and, he, and the, the pen he made me sign with, for some reason I ended up keeping it. So I put it in my pocket and ink spilled everywhere on my new jeans, all over my wallet, all over my phone. So, yeah, I'm haunted by the back room, so I don't think we'll be going back. Well, we probably will go back if we come back here. But but we ended up at our diner, didn't we? Court Square Diner. Yeah, the diner was so good. So good. We just ordered far too much, as always. Yeah. But... Anyway, talking of food, should we go and get some more? Yeah. Come on in. I'll see you in a bit. See you in a bit. So we've just got off the subway and we've bumped into this. It's called The Vessel. It's one of New York's newest attractions. Basically, it's, it's just a bunch of stairways that interlink and you can climb to the top. But given how much walking and exercise we've done the last uh, week, we're going to give it a miss because we're going to the High Line instead. But it's pretty impressive, isn't it? So we've uh, started our walk on the High Line. This is a disused train track they've converted into like a pedestrian walkway slash park type thing. Uh, it goes on for a couple of miles, I think, but you get some really good views. So Shana's already got the walking stick out, so I don't know how long we'll last, but let's see. finish the High Line. Uh, what did you make of it? Yeah, it was good. It's a nice walk. Yeah, it's, it's really pretty. Uh, it's clever how they've done it. Uh, of course, a bit windy down here. Um, <laughs> Sorry about the barn. Yeah. <laughs> so we're just going to go and get some food in uh, Chelsea Market. That's per everything out here. It looks pretty big again. Seems like there's hundreds of different little shops and stalls and stuff. So what is it we're after? Tacos. So we're going to try and find the tacos probably first of all. Let's see what else we can find. So we found it. Looks pretty amazing. So we got one pork, I think it is, no, mm. beef I think it is, and one oh, chicken. Okay. And she couldn't wait to get stuck in as, as per. So we both said we fancied a hot dog, and we've come to this place. It's like a butcher's where they cook it on the premises. Apparently it's the best one in New York, so we'll see. 
So we've stopped off at this uh, seafood place and this is one of their uh, New England clam chowders. But they do everything from whole lobsters, crab legs, sushi, freshly made. But I'm a sucker for a soup, so I'm gonna give this a try. So we just finished our final bit of shopping. We're going for a quick drink now at Sean's Bar. We, we kind of had to, right? Um, and then we're off to our steak meal tonight. So it's been a, a brilliant, brilliant time. Really enjoyed it. It's a bit sad it's coming to an end, really. So we've arrived at our restaurant. Looks amazing. We've got a lobster bisque, fried calamari. And the only thing that looks better than the food tonight is <laughs> sitting opposite me. That's lovely, thank you. So we're ending the holiday back at our favourite bar, Dutch Kills, after an absolute amazing steak meal, but we'll talk about that a bit later. So I've got the most feminine looking cocktail on the menu, and uh, Charlotte's got a coffee based, uh, what's it called? It's called Tiger Chilled Coffee. Tiger Chilled Coffee. With absinthe. With absinthe, so uh, early night tonight I think. <laughs> Evening everyone, um, so that's pretty much about it from us now isn't it? Yeah. Um, so we had a really unbelievable meal um, at Club A Steakhouse. It was just, we was debating on the way home whether the steak in Vegas that we had at um, Camelot, how it compared to this. And I'm of the opinion that I think the one out here was better. You're the other way, aren't you? Yeah. But the fine margins. They was both amazing. The, the steak was just to die for. It come to 205 um, including tax so that was a porterhouse for two um, I had the lobster bisque to start you had the calamari, calamari. they also bought round um, a little uh, mushroom ravioli uh, one each after the starters which was complimentary um, so we had the steak we had a side of mash side of cream spinach and a baked potato yep. and then they gave us um, some free desserts as well didn't they mm -hmm. um, it was <laughs> Was it profiteroles? Um, uh, profiteroles, tiramisu, yeah. and like a chocolate mousse cake. Yeah, and again, that was that was for nothing. With a beer and a glass of wine, two hundred dollars. So it weren't too bad, really, especially considering where you are. And the service was brilliant. Yeah. So thoroughly good really night. Good. Uh, we went back to our favourite bar, Dutch Kills, just down the road. Had a nice cocktail, mm -hmm. just to finish the holiday. Um, so we've got a final bit of packing to do, then we're flying back to Gatwick tomorrow, unfortunately. Um, but what we'll do, we'll do a bit more of a thorough review video on Saturday or Sunday, depending on how we're feeling. Because um, it well, feel, yeah. feels like there's a lot we've not really spoke about. And we're um, going to a gig on um, well, Saturday night, <laughs> which we didn't think through. I don't know whose smart idea that was. Um, it, was. it was mine, yeah. yeah. Um, but yeah, I just want to say thank, well, two thank yous really. Thanks to all our friends, well, not friends really, but family who have given us money for Christmas and birthdays. Um, that's all we asked for, wasn't it, was dollars. Yeah. So a lot of the stuff we've done, like the attractions and the meal tonight was paid for by them. So um, thanks for that because we've just had an amazing time. Yeah. Um, and thanks to everyone that's watched and left comments and liked and subscribed, etc. The feedback's been really good, so thank you. Um, next stop for us is Berlin in May. Corfu then in June. Uh, Berlin for catfish. Yeah, there's only a short one in Berlin for Charlotte's favourite band. Um, Corfu June, Budapest September, uh, and then Vegas in December. But obviously, we'll, we'll... and then Lanzarote. Oh, and Lanzarote, in, and Lanzarote in December as well. Yeah, I forgot about that. Um, but we'll speak more on the sort of summary video on Saturday or Sunday anyway. So again, thanks for watching, and we'll speak to you soon. Take care.